This is the Nissan Figaro. In this video, I'll tell you the story of this quirky and interesting car. So stick around. The Nissan Figaro was first introduced to the public at the Tokyo Motor Show in 1989. It was so popular that Nissan decided to build it, but for one model year only, in 1991, and only for the Japanese market. The name comes from Mozart's opera The Marriage of Figaro. The retro styling was intended to give the sense of a 1950s Italian cars. At the time, Nissan said the styling was intended to convey, quote, a delicate feeling of stylish elegance in everyday life, while at the same time satisfying, quote, a zestful desire for a good time. And let's be honest, who doesn't want that in a car? The car is based on the Nissan Micra K10 platform, a boring economy car that was called the March in the Japanese market. Under the hood is the Nissan MA10ET, 987cc, turbocharged four-cylinder engine that drives the front wheels. The engine makes 76 horsepower and 78 pound-feet of torque. Nissan used a thermoplastic resin to make the front fenders. The idea was to reduce the weight and to be resistant to corrosion. The curb weight is only 1,790 pounds, and the car can obtain 32 miles per gallon. The top speed, not that you'd want to try, is 106 miles per hour. The car sits on 12-inch wheels and has disc brakes up front and old-fashioned drum brakes in the rear. Inside, the Figaro is a 2 plus 2 seating design, but the rear seats really are unusable, unless it's for a small child or a chihuahua. The standard features include air conditioning, a 3-speed automatic transmission, and a stereo with both cassette and CD player. Although the AM-FM radio is mostly useless to U.S. owners, since Japan uses different frequencies than the United States for both AM and FM. All Figaro's came with a manual top that folds down into the tiny trunk. Nissan offered the car in only four colors that represent the four seasons. Lapis gray for winter, emerald green for spring, pale aqua for summer, and topaz mist for fall. Nissan had planned to only build 8,000 Figaro's, but it turned out to be so popular they increased production to over 20,000. Prospective buyers had to enter a lottery for the right to buy one. The car became a cult classic in the UK, where many of them were imported. In fact, there is a shop that specializes in the Figaro, appropriately named the Figaro Shop, that is located about 60 miles west of London. Due to the U.S. Department of Transportation import restrictions, we did not finally see any of these come to the United States shores until 2016. The owner of this car bought it fully restored from the Figaro shop. They installed this small plaque under the hood, indicating it was finished in May of 2019. I'll include the link to their website in the description below in case you want to check them out. The odometer shows over 156,000 kilometers, which is just short of 97,000 miles. The owner from Metro Detroit, Michigan, said the cost for the car, including shipping to Michigan, was about $32,000. In comparison, the original price in 1991 was 1,870,000 yen, or about $13,650. A quick look at bringatrailer.com shows they sell anywhere from $12,000 to $30,000, depending on condition and mileage. And that is the quirky but interesting 1991 Nissan Figaro. My name is Tom Straup, and you've been watching Find the Right Road. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and consider subscribing to my channel. Thanks, and we'll catch you next time.